What up, what up, what up? King's Court Network, it's your boy, King Mumbles. So, um, have you seen the video that I played? Um, uh, I guess he's been around for a while, Big Groove. Shout out Big Groove, look him up or whatever. He does this all over. I've only seen like one or two videos. I just seen them today. Um, this video is not really about him. You know, do your thing. You're not hurting nobody. It's really about um, being bothered by the negative comments um, and the stereotypical, the stereotypical images that are forced upon us, especially as black men. Like, I was seeing men, women, things, the comments reading it, and, like, it really did um, bother me. And I'll let you know the story on why I took it kind of personal. One, growing up and stuff, like, I was always a dan like, dancer, like, you see, like, the, um, movie with B2K and stuff, like, that, like, that was me, I was in dance crews, like, club dance, that, you know, so, um, it's always been, I actually wish I took dance classes, because it's always been something, um, I've been into, so, um, I have um, two sons, twin boys, and a couple of years ago, so they would have been like nine, ten, um, we went to um, this cultural festival at this place, and they were playing some music, and, you know, we were just sitting there kind of um, grooving or whatever, and my one son, you could see him look like he wanted to get up and stuff. And he was literally like holding himself to down to dance. He was like literally fighting the the will to dance. So I go, what's wrong? Like, get up and dance. And he said something like, because this is years ago, and like that really, but he's like, no, um, I told um, guys, it's not cool for guys to dance. And I honestly, one of the things that bothered me is um, I should have pushed more to find out who told him that so I could put that person in check. But I sat there, so I said, you know, um, so he said it. I sat there and I went, really? So I go, um, so I looked at him and I went, is daddy cool? And he's like, yeah. So... Um, I got up and I didn't like, like, I kind of overdid it. Like, I started, I came a little bit better dancer than Big Groove, but like, I started dancing and I made him get up and dance with me. And I made my the other brother. And we sat there and we were dancing, like, you know, it was almost like if you remember Fresh Prince when he used to do the dumb dancing and stuff, like, I was running man in and stuff. And I had to sit him down and I was like, do you like to dance? And he's like, yeah. Do you have fun when you dance? He's like, yeah. And I go, do me one promise. And he goes, what? Do not let the pressures, the ideals, the things of anybody else take away um, what you enjoy and what you love. Do not let anybody else tell you who you are supposed to be. And, um, so reading the comments and the pushback and the stuff that, um, Big Groove is getting, um, really reminded me, like, I seen some person posted, like, some guy posted, you know, put down, stop the dancing and pick up a football. I was like, are you out of your, like, 
out of your mind to tell another man, like, a man not like, what, like, black people can only, like, play sports? And here's the thing, because I'm, I'm old, so, like, I've seen a lot of changes in community and stuff like that. And people don't even see when they're pushing this projection of this image of what a proper black man is, the problem is, because, put it this way, like, before the, before probably 91, 92, like, before around them times, you weren't cool if you couldn't dance. You, you, you weren't, you weren't, like, like, now time, now you can go because you're dressed in a certain way and stand up on a wall at a party and you can be considered cool. Like, well, like, you weren't cool if you couldn't dance. Like, 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 you couldn't dance. If you look into Jamaican culture, I don't know right now, but I know 90, like, previously and whatever, like, the baddest men in Jamaica were the ones in the dance crews and stuff like that. You look in Africa, you, like, black people are everywhere and stuff like that, but from ancient times going to war till now and whatever, dance is one thing anywhere in the world is part of our culture. Like, one of the things, because it said it happened around the 90s, like, and stuff like that, into our music and whatever, one of the worst things that happened to our culture in North America, in our hip hop music, was somebody told black guy that it wasn't cool to dance. Like, um, like, think about it, like, I, like, cause I rapped and everything, so I grew up on the things of Heavy D and Big Daddy Kane and like I'm just saying like be very careful of the projections that you are putting on people and the demands of what it is to be black and thing like that and make sure that these projections are logical reasonable sensible and at the, the end of the day to our benefit and I will say this, I said it in the comments, and I'll say it here. A society where it's not cool for a black man to dance is not a society that you want to live in. If you have a disagree or you want to say something, I really don't care because you're wrong. But leave it in the comments and let me know your opinion. It's King's Court Network. Politics of life. Like, subscribe, share, and we're out.